economic health of nearby shopping districts will be adversely affected. That said, the transportation report submitted by Mr. Crossy's firm, BA Group, has concluded that there is adequate transportation capacity <laughs> and that there will be no adverse impact, uh, impact uh, to the neighboring community. Nonsense. 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 Fucking bullshit. <laughs> the, conclusions, the conclusions of that report have been accepted by the city's technical staff. Shame. Oh. Shame. By way of background, 70% of the customers of the Loblaws store at Queen and Portland arrive on foot, bicycle, or by public transportation. <laughs> it's actually not smaller. We expect this center to be similar. <laughs> the second area of concern I would like to address is market impact. Reports submitted by Mr. Annan's firm, Urban Metrics, have concluded that our proposal will not adversely affect the economic health of nearby shopping districts. And I agree I shares to sell you, fucker! Despite the initial findings, and since filing our application, we have conducted further research. While the report is not yet complete, we expect to submit those findings to the city by the end of this month. At a very high level, the research confirms that Kenton Market, Chinatown, and other nearby shopping districts draw support from a very large market area, much larger than the market area that will be served by Walmart and our other tenants. <laughs> Bullshit! Bullshit! The also confirms, the research also confirms that many local residents already shop at Walmart, and it's the overall, uh, in the overall public interest to provide additional shopping choices at a more convenient location. Fuck you! <laughs> consequently, shop at Walmart. consequently shop at we believe Walmart. our proposal responds to the substantial downtown residential growth and is entirely consistent with the city's official plan policy that encourages, I quote, a broad range of shopping opportunities for local residents and employees in a variety of settings. <laughs> We acknowledge that the proposed development has sparked considerable debate. Duh! So we're being proactive. Uh, at the end of the day, as stated, we'd like to be a good neighbor. Oh, yeah. Since the last public meeting on June 6th, we've initiated a number of outreach activities to learn uh, about your opinions, concerns, and how to best serve the needs of the community. By leaving! Yeah. <laughs> By leaving! <laughs> We've been in the neighborhood asking people to share their concerns, feedback, and most importantly, ideas as to how we can be a good neighbor. I've also met one on one with a number of individuals. We're learning a lot from these conversations. We can hear oh, suggestions me? and ideas from the community. Who asked me? To that end, we developed a website as a place for people to provide feedback. Please visit, to the extent you're interested, wwwriocan 410 446 bathurstca Yeah, come on! Why don't we save your question for question and answers and I'd be happy to talk. Thanks for listening. That's sarcasm if you can't tell. As stated, uh, we're open to ways uh, to refine or improve our proposal and look forward to your continued input. Bullshit. Uh, but we remain confident that our proposal is in the public interest and consistent with the city's official plan policy. Boo! Uh, with that, didn't attend the planning meeting. <laughs> With that, I'll open up the floor to questions. 